Welcome back to another Red Beard Outdoors episode, and welcome back to episode two of Training with Sean Kinkler. If you missed episode one, I'll leave a link in the description below. You can go check it out. Today, we're going to get on horseback. I don't want to give too much away, but we're going to see some dogs run pretty big and point a lot of birds. So let's not waste any more time and jump right into the video. Welcome to Red Beard Outdoors. My wife and I travel all over the country with our Dodge Ram 3500 Laramie Longhorn Mega Cab and our 40 foot Featherlight horse trailer with living quarters. We travel with our various number of Irish setters and our three horses, Biscuit, Melody, and Tara. this field there was an antelope and it made it very difficult to hunt this field because this antelope would not leave the dogs alone so uh, that was kind of a unique encounter I got him. Hands out there, left. I got him. Whoop, whoop, whoop. That's where I 
saw that first bird get up to Whoop! Went right behind it. I don't know where it came out, but it had to be in here. There's a bird! You get me in this Hartman thicket, I'll be damned if I'm taking a deer out of here. <laughs> Yeah. Storm, come here. Dan, come here. Come here. Come here. There's a lot of trouble, you know. Uh -huh. I don't really storm her about once a week, once or twice a week. Still, still doesn't matter anymore. But Take it. I'll get her next week. I'll get her tomorrow. But we, when I say she can take it, I ain't freaking playing. She didn't step, she's leaning on me. Huh? If she didn't try to move, she just leaning in my hand. I guess. No, I know, but she needs to wake back up a little bit. She would. She crowded that bird to a half a step, right? Yeah, there. she sure did. Dan had it. That track, yeah, uh, right down there you can see those four wheeler tracks, left front, 11 o'clock. Come here, come here. Okay, next up we're working on dogs that are broke or very close to being broke with quail and pigeons. Here, boss. Uh, careful. Whoop. I'm gonna flush one bird for you. Whoop! 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 Yeah. 
You know what we're doing, don't you? That's good. What a pigeon's gonna do for her. Take that loose quail's at. I had it. You said it got up again? I had it right between you and that hay bale. But you said it got up again, one over there. There's, there's one that landed like middle mi middle of the hay bales. All right, we can flush it. I got one sitting and one in front of the. That's it. They walk, 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 walk back in. Come on, somebody come around the back there. Yeah, walk into this way. I got him coming right. This way, turn us all the way, almost a big gap. Straight into him. The left. Yeah, anywhere. Uh, feel good. Come here, die. Take a picture of it and send it to. Y'all bark that bird down again? Yeah, right in front of you on the on the edge over there. Okay, we can point this one again and then use that one. Or not. Um, that's what that, that one I threw back in there is right off here. Is that, that, 
Oh, oh, oh. We got plenty of birds. I'm going to make him move. You still got shells? You just saw that pigeon cloud, too. Bird nest. All right, go on. Well, you just wasted both of them. Yeah. Ah, but here rock, here rock. Good boy. Got a big nose. He ain't playing either. I mean, I know he is. Here rock, here rock. Ah. Okay, next up, Kelly grabbed a GoPro and went out to different fields than what Sean and I went to this morning. And uh, they uh, trained their own dogs and got into some birds. So check it out. Whoop, 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 trip, whoop. Whoop, 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 Oh, that's Trip. Never mind. God dang it. it that's fine. He's He's been introduced to guns. <laughs> Thank you for letting my young dog do that. Although it's probably okay for Ang or Angus to have that. He needed that experience. That point left side in right side.
Okay, that was freaking awesome. We need to watch that a few more times. Wow, what an amazing find. That's one of those finds that you're really glad you caught on camera. How many birds did you guys count? I think I counted 11. Thank you guys so much for watching. I had a great time at Sean's camp and I want to thank him for letting us come and run our dogs with them and kind of show us a thing or two. But uh, that's going to do it for today's episode. If you guys enjoyed this episode, please, please hit that subscribe button. Make sure to like the video and hit the notification bell. That lets YouTube know that I'm doing good things over here on my channel and it helps you guys view more of my stuff. So if you can do me a favor, please go do that for me. And I'll see you guys in the next Red Beard Outdoors episode. We make our way down to Kansas and uh, we get to start competing in some field trials. So make sure you stay tuned. Remember, get outdoors and keep hunting.